kind of tried. <laughs> Sorry. Nice try. I don't know where to look. Zach, what's this, what's this experience been like to go from Tony from the Orange to down? One step away from being drafted. Yeah, it's kind of surreal, you know. You grow up want to dream of being in the NFL, but like you want to do that and you work for it, and, you know, to be on the doorstep of that, you know, it's a blessing. How do you think you did out there today? I feel like I did good. I feel like I was really able to show up, you know, my explosiveness and, you know, just my ability to, you know, bend the edge and things like that. Have you been having any conversations with teams or something? Yeah. Sharing? Yeah, most definitely. I feel like I've talked to a, like, a bunch of teams at this point. I don't even know all of them, so I couldn't tell you. But I feel, I feel like, you know, I've definitely been talking to teams. Did you have a favorite team growing up? No, nah, no, nah, I didn't. Did you follow much of the NFL? Uh, I mean, I used to watch football, but, like, I wasn't, like, a diehard of any team for real, so... You've seen this day before from the perspective of a guy that wasn't necessarily going into pro day, but now you did. Yeah. Just what did you learn from those years of being part of this atmosphere and then now doing it? Honestly, you really can't prepare for it. Like, you know, you watch a guy do it and you get the feel of what's going on, but, you know, being out here and, and um, doing the drills is, is different than just watching, you know. So, but then once you get out there, it's just football. You've been doing – it's like we do it every single day before practice, so it's nothing, nothing different. Speaking of things that you can't prepare for, how do you go into meetings with teams at those interviews? It's yeah. completely new. You can you. actually prepare for those a little bit. So, how do you do that? Uh, you know, just talking to, like, meeting with my agent and things like that, you know, getting guys who are, you know, former GMs and things of that nature, you know, talking to me and feeling – Asking, asking similar questions they're going to ask, you know, just being prepared and then really just be yourself, you know. They're trying to get to know you and just, you know, put your best foot forward. What's the weirdest part of this process? Like, the weird question you've gotten, just what's like the thing that you don't It's a lot, but I really can't put my finger on one. Sometimes I just, my, in the back of my head, I just be like, but it's, it's, like I said, it's a blessing, so, you know. Zach, what do you think you've shown yeah, you know, getting out here, just confirming that I'm like athletically, I'm not normal. You know, confirming that on the field. You know, getting guys to see that first person, like, oh yeah, this dude really is that explosive, that fast, that twitchy, that long, that strong. You know, things like that. You, know? you feel like your best football is definitely ahead of you. I mean, is, that, is that your sense? I really do, and I, and I have right now. I have that drive to go get it. Like I want to. I really want to. You know, prove people who you know. Believed in me right, you know. Yeah, but sometimes it takes a while, right? I mean, uh, Everybody's path is different. Yeah. Yeah. By the way, you're standing long jump. How long was it? Did you it was 10 3. It was all right. It was all right. It was pretty good. It was all right, yeah. <laughs> Why no 40 today? Um, you know, just reasons. Were you happy with the standing of the broad jump there? Uh, I was trying to get, I, I feel like my PR is a little better than that, but it, it, was, it was a good jump. Is that your, your frame of mind when you're running the 